Roger, what's the name? United X-ray, X-ray, Roger, what's the name? Uh, well, the name here is Marvin, Mike, Alpha Romeo, Victor, India, November, over. Roger Marvin, and where are you located, sir? Marvin, and where are you located, sir? Hey, all right, um, uh, Jim, good evening to you. I'm located just south of the city of Chicago, on roughly, uh, roughly about 13 miles uh, just south of the Chicago city limits, and uh, about two and a half, three miles. Uh, Indiana borderline, out here in the suburb called Linwood. Uh, Linwood, Lima Yankee, November, Whiskey, Oscar, Oscar Delta, Linwood, Illinois, over. Roger that, Marvin. Well, I've got you on my uh, local antenna system uh, on the uh, on the uh, 90 degree uh, uh, 10-foot vertical magnetic loop. Uh, your audio is just really sounds good. I, I I haven't really looked at it on the spectrum analyzer, but uh, it has uh, a fairly broad uh, content. So why don't you come back and uh, give me about 10, 15 seconds about your antenna system, and let me look at your audio on the spectrum analyzer. All right, QSL, QSL on that. I think I may have checked with you once before a while back with Knox and Shore. But the antenna here is a, uh, a Force 12. Uh, it's a C4 SXL, uh, 8 element Yagi. Uh, covers uh, SXL, uh, 8 element Yagi. To 40 meters, uh, 2 meters. Uh, pointed to way there, over. Roger, Roger. I have so many options here. Sometimes it, it's crazy. But I wanted to hear your your audio clearly, and uh, the, the, most of these SDRs roll off uh, starting at about 250 cycles, 300, 250 cycles. So to get a real real picture of what you're doing, I either have to call, uh, use Arlington SDR, which is a full range uh, audio spectrum, or my local uh, receiver stuff, which is good down to 100 cycles. But your audio curve does look, look very well. Now, uh, I might uh, comment on your uh, dynamic range. I think we could probably... Uh, I'll fatten you up just a tad if you would be interested. Well, I'll listen. Well, I'll listen. I don't know if I'll ever change it or anything like that, but I will listen and uh, uh, I take uh, corrective crit crit criticism, no problem at all. And uh, whatever you give me, I write it down there. Over. Roger. Okay, now I'm looking at your dynamic range again just at that moment on the uh, Georgia SDR, and it looks like you are very close to being right on target there. Uh, usually, I, our setup procedure is uh, to engage the compressor at a 3. It's just a very token amount that you'll never hear on the air, but it uh, it does exactly what it needs to do. And then after we get that compressor in line at about a 3, we run up to the ALC with mic gain in hand. And as we speak fairly rapidly, 100, 200, 300, uh, we adjust the ALC for mid-scale to two-thirds by way of the uh, mic gain control. Roger? By way of the Mic gain control, Roger. Hey, Roger, on that I got it. Uh, compression at about three, and ALC at about uh, mid scale. Uh, I was talking there, over. Yes, sir. Now that's you know the ideal spot, the sweet spot is that area halfway between mid scale and two thirds. But you can't just ride there. You have to have some swing there. So we just say that spot is uh, uh, ALC is uh, mid range to two thirds, Roger. Two-thirds, Roger. Uh, QSL on that mid-range between uh, 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 mid-scale and two-thirds. Okay, got it. No problem, sir. Uh, appreciate it very much, and uh, we may, may check into that. Uh, and we will be, um, I guess, checking for your um, YouTube page to come up also there. Over. Uh, Roger that. Now, on your uh, equalization, uh, you could stand to have a couple of clicks more top-end EQ. Uh, my personal preference would be uh, two clicks boost uh, top end uh, uh, treble EQ, Roger. And, uh, uh, treble EQ, Roger. So two clicks, uh, let me write it down, two clicks of top end. Got it. Roger, Roger, Marvin, what radio are you running, sir? Roger, Roger, Marvin, what radio are you running, sir? Yeah, running here at the uh, Yesu. FTDX 5000 MP, and the uh, microphone is a Heil uh, PR781. Roger, Roger. Yeah, two clicks more treble EQ, I think, will uh, increase your articulation and therefore your uh, readability uh, when you are in the heavy QRM uh, situations, Roger. In the heavy QRM uh, situations, Roger. 
Roger, Roger. All right, appreciate it, sir. I'm going to get on out of your way, let you pick up some more guys that stand on the side. I do appreciate the uh, uh, the settings over there. I did write them down. We'll put it in. Uh, actually, we're going to rewrite them again in, in the back of my log book here on one of my pages here. Uh, just in case we get around to playing around inside the uh, menu again. I uh, will make you those to try there for sure. That uh, uh, KC9VKV from Whiskey 9, your 90th X ray, X ray. Roger, Roger, Marvin, 73, sir. Thanks for dropping by. If you get a chance, uh, join us next Friday. We'd love to have you. This is uh, KC9 VKV, the Friday afternoon, QSO Net. If you have a radio you want to check out, give me a shout. If you have a radio you want to check out, give me a shout.